Welcome, welcome. Have you got lots of these little paper scraps where you've torn off from book pages because you don't want that blank edge? Well, I'm going to make some postcards today using those up. And also I thought it would make a really good journal background too. So find yourself a blank page or just a piece of cardboard or recycling. And let's use up these scraps. <laughs> a very gentle, a very gentle time we're going to have and also lots of positive words. <laughs> and replayers, I'm going to read the chat out. And here comes Beth. And here comes Penny. The, the girls from Florida are here. <laughs> All is well with the world. And there's Kelly. Good morning, Kelly. So nice to see you. <laughs> oh, and there's Dar. Let, let me, where's little Freddie? Can you see him there? <laughs> there he is. There he is. And there's Carol. Good morning, Carol. Oh, so nice to see everybody. It really is. So nice. I'm just going to be, this is great because what if I'm doing something really gentle and it means that we can, we can have a good old chat because we like to, don't we? <laughs> Kimberly, I don't like to miss out on any of the chat. There's Kimberly. Good morning, Kimberly. Have you put your garden to bed for the, for the winter now? I know you had a wonderful vegetable patch this year. Welcome, Doki Doki Forest, into the live chat. Is the light on me dreadful? I want it on the desk, but not on me. <laughs> Am I in the twilight zone at the top here? Welcome, Oki, um, Doki Doki Forest, into the chat for the first time. Welcome, welcome. So glad that you could join us on a live. You, you've been commenting on videos and on my community tab I have shared um Doki Doki Forest's channel and her name is Amy so welcome Amy to the chat here's Barbara oh good morning Barbara <laughs> oh dear maybe there's two videos going on I don't know whether this video here is going out to fairyland <laughs> oh lovely so nice to see everybody. <laughs> it's lovely that you can join us live, Amy. <laughs> and Kimberly, good um, Kimberly, uh, Cheryl, Cheryl, good morning. So nice to see you. Have you got any of that fudge left, um, Cheryl? It looked delicious. And as someone said, you took a fantastic photograph of it. It was it could be in a magazine, that photograph. It really could. <laughs> oh, there's little pickles. Good morning. And yes, happy Monday. Or as we like to say in the UK, good afternoon, little pickles. <laughs> oh. As I was saying to the lovely replayers, who's got any of these bits? So you have the painty paper, let me show you. And then you're making something that you're left with. Say, oh, you don't want the white, the clear edges. So I've got all those and I've saved them up. They were just on my desk, I think, after one of my lives. And I just started to gently play this is just a very everything I'm doing at the moment seems to be lovely and simple that's just the phase I'm in at the moment I think <laughs> you can as I was saying before you can make you can make this into a journal page as well so if you want to find um a blank page I, I haven't got many left in this journal now you can um you can use this as a background too. So here's the finished 
item. I'll take you through what I do, but you can adapt it to your to your to what you want to do. This little Freddy, bless him. <laughs> it wasn't rainy, but quite muddy underfoot today. So he's had a lovely time and a good old towel down. <laughs> I'm actually looking, see this piece, I've rejected this piece. For what I'm doing, I am I want this paint, but this, this bit without paint. You'll see in a minute what I do. <laughs> it's just literally from playing after one of the streams. As I say, it's not rocket science. <laughs> oh, get yourself a nice, I'm just looking for a tissue. Get yourself a nice, I can't find one. Let's open a new one. Barbara Every sent me a little packet of tissues. <laughs> Wasn't that sweet? <laughs> Oh dear, I need to get a new one out. <laughs> oh, so lovely to see everyone. I can't believe it's Monday already. There we are. Let me just tap that down. Yes, welcome, welcome everybody. So nice to see you. There's Pam and Pusscat. Welcome, welcome. And Trudy, so nice to see you. And Stephanie, sorry, my... um. My chat froze for a little minute. Let me go back. Oh, it's so nice to see you. Good evening, Puscat. Can you believe um, Pam's already had her Monday? I do hope you had a peaceful Monday. Yeah. Oh, no. Um, Trudy's coming. Gargar -gar for gluing. She's saying she's going to try and say hi to everyone. Oh, no, don't worry. Say a blanket hi to everyone because... Yes, it gets a bit stressful. <laughs> Otherwise, so nice to see you, Trudy. Good afternoon. And there's Stephanie G. She was just saying, Stephanie was just saying she's put out another video. I'll try and link that later. It takes me a while to get round to doing that, but I will link that. <laughs> Petra, it's so nice to see you in chat. Good afternoon. <laughs> oh, have I missed anybody else? Yeah. Let me just go back up. Look at me. I love to glue, but I also like to chat. It's a very sociable, chatty time we're having. Oh, Cheryl's saying pat pat to Freddie. I know. He says hi, Cheryl. When I first started streaming, there, there's a lot to remember. And Cheryl used to be there and remind me to feed, to um, give Freddie his treat. See, look, even these little bits, it's got a little bit of paint and a little bit of blank space. That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> Oh, there's Janet Canada, and we've got Barbara from Canada too. Yeah, <laughs> haven't we got so many wonderful friends here? Yes, definitely, definitely, Barbara. So lovely. Mm. You went to the hairdressers today for your monthly cut and colour. How wonderful. And have you got any art planned for this this week um Pam how lovely do you feel a lot lighter and brighter to have have that appointment it's nice that you're treating yourself and a little bit of self-care that's lovely but, um Pam Janice says blanket good day evening and welcome and welcome to the new chat members <laughs> and friends in the box <laughs> Oh, yeah, Janice. Our lovely Janice is getting ready for work. I trust that you managed to. Oh, no. You said... Janice said she went into work over the Thanksgiving holidays. Yes. Working hard for that newspaper. And I know Mondays is a particularly hard day, but you're here while you get ready. And then sometimes you join us afterwards, don't you? Mm. There's Lynn. Good morning. Betsy Doodles just, just showed how to do those adorable paper birds. You would think you would love them. Oh, I haven't heard of Betsy Doodle, but um, Betsy 
doodle. Thank you, thank you, Lynn. I'm sure I will. But Trudy sent told me about her and had sent her some happy mail. So I I went over and yes, I do like I I did like her channel. She's an English lady. Yes. Is anybody able to put a link in? Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Lynn, for, for telling me about that. It's lovely that we can, we know what one another likes and we can share. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, darling, good morning. Darling, saying hello and to everybody. Right, my quote, you don't need to be great. Oh, yes, okay. I'm reading it out for the gentle listeners and replayers. You don't need to be great, skilled artist to create art. Creativity is for everyone. Is for everyone. Thank you. Everyone. I'll read it out properly now. I've written it down. Thank you. Thank you, Lisa. Lisa Jane. You've sent me some messages on Messenger, Jana, and photos. You've inspired. Lisa, thank you. I will go into my Facebook account and sort that out. And yes, I, I, I think I literally just noticed that just before I went live. Thank you for sharing those words of encouragement. That's really, yeah. Calls this AM, then work. You haven't heard of Betsy Doodle? And there's a link from Janice has got that. Yeah, she's really lovely. Trudy re recommended her. And Beth, thank you, dear. Thank you so much. Um, you don't have to be great. Is it Anne Skill? Great. Uh, a great and skilled artist to create art creativity is for everyone that's amazing thank you if i've got it wrong i know that little pickles will message me um, as well mm. yeah betsy doodles thank you jean and good morning mug first mug of the day for jean's got my butterfly one <laughs> Got another one for later. Um, you've got a happy mail from her this week. So Jean knows Betsy Doodles too. Oh, lovely. It's lovely to find new new channels. I love that. Good morning, Gail. So nice to see you. And how's, how's our little Elvin doing? Oh, he's lovely. Mm. Oh, thank you. Thank you for those words of encouragement. Um, thank you, little pickles. <laughs> hmm. Oh, look at this. Uh, we've got another. I love, I'm loving this. A flower does not compete with the next. Yeah. Flower. Yeah. It just blooms. Mm, yeah. Yeah, that's part of being kind to ourselves and not comparing ourselves. So I put on this postcard, you are enough. Not comparing ourselves to others. It's almost, it, it stops us sometimes, doesn't it? Because we don't think we're up to it. I know, I know. Let me show you the next in making this background so this is a postcard but it can equally be so be this is just um just something i don't know i was doing this after one of the lies because this when your art supplies are out on your desk it, that's inspiring too there's nashua good morning we we've met each other um this morning, didn't we? I'm looking, I'm possibly looking for a paintbrush. Um, oh, well, I've got this one. It's not what I quite wanted. Let me just not scrape the chair and I will get 
little paintbrush. There we are. It's probably buried in papers. <laughs> oh, you've had a look at Betsy Doodles. Yeah, a brilliant. Yes, yeah. I think that sounds that sounds fun to find new people. Thank you. Now I'm going to be using my water soluble crayons. You, that means you can move them with water. They're a lovely ancient set that I've had for a long, long time. And that's when we had the swatch prompt. Let me pull my sleeves up so they don't get too dirty. There's Patty. Good morning, Patty. So nice to see you. So nice to see you. And Ruth, good morning, Ruth. So nice to see you up there in your chili. Are you down in your basement sewing room? Already. So when so you you stuck it on, it doesn't look much, but it does become something. We're building up some layers of colours and textures. So then I'm where it's the blank book pages, it means you can put the colours. It's great to have scraps on your desk because and then I'm just Going through all the colours because it's just fun. I love these actually. They're quite waxy. It's a very old stamping up product. I don't know whether they're made anymore, but there would be an equivalent. Would the, the equivalent to these be, um, what are they called? Because they're quite waxy feel to them. Hmm. Oh, you're knitting hats for the boys. Oh, how wonderful. Oh, absolutely wonderful. I'm knitting my Christmas scarf. No, crocheting my, with the Christmas wool that my friend Leslie gave me. And then I'm, she gave me some more wool, some yarn, which I, isn't that sweet of her? And I'm going to be making a Christmas hat. <laughs> oh, Brenda, good to see you. Brenda, yes, thank you for being so honest because honesty is fantastic because you are not alone because I think that's part of human nature. We, we do, we do compare ourselves to, to one another, definitely. Mm. Yeah, absolutely. And you're getting better at it. I think it's something we have to tell ourselves and remind ourselves. I think the reason I remind you is because I want to remind myself. Um, it's yes. Especially because at the moment, my, my creating is fairly simple. And yes, I'm reminding myself. So yeah, that's what I do. And then where it it looks a bit looks a bit busy for the men at thanks Cheryl dear I'm where their lines where the papers join up I'm going to get maybe the red and I'm just going to go over those a bit more because oh that's lovely the paint goes into the cracks as well in the, into the creases where it joins up isn't it wonderful to have something that there's no right or wrong with this. I'm telling you my process, but there's no right or wrong. It'd be great if I was in shot as well, wouldn't it? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, it's Ruth. It's early in the morning, and thank you. Talking about eyes, um, all through the stream, we're going to be keeping our lovely Mary, who may be at this moment at the hospital wherever she's going she's having an eye off today so we're really thinking of Mary today keeping her in our hearts definitely oh Patty thank you I love this community too definitely definitely oh let me just I missed something. I got carried away with my, mm, 
Yeah, I, I, yes, that was Brenda. I get carried away with my, you can see how relaxing this must be. And because these move, these crowns, I'm going to get my water out and then I'm just going to, oh, lovely. It's like doing a little bit of watercolour, but just very gentle. Thank you. Thank you, um, Barbara. It's, it's like, it's not snowing outside, but I'm starting to get winter things and it's not too hot. I can have a scarf around my neck now. <laughs> oh, flowed like one. Oh, yes. She's got her poncho on. She's, of course, last year she saw me making the ponchos and desperately wanted one. So, yes. <laughs> flow. I think she would like a a sequiny scarf. You're right. I, I'm going to write it down though. Um, Barbara. <laughs> because I'm in a writing down phase at the moment. It, it, it does help so much. <sighs> right. But yes, so just where you put your water soluble crayons. Gelatos. That was the word I was looking for. Do you think these are quite similar to gelatos? They might be about 10 years old. So don't you love it when it's like a comfy slipper? <laughs> There's Jennifer. Oh, Julia, good afternoon. Did I say good afternoon to you? Oh, my like. Miss lovely Jennifer, come on in. If I'm missing out on saying hi to you, can you just say, excuse me, Janet? I haven't had to do that the other way. You haven't said hello to me. <laughs> and there, the, the, I don't, this isn't anything new. I just, it's something I just enjoyed doing the other day. And you can see the backgrounds beginning to come together now. It's got, because it's got some painty paper acrylic and it's got some watercolour, so it gives it a nice texture. So the next stage is on here. I need that to dry a little bit. So I need the next stage. I'm going to waft it, waft it around and we chat while it dries. All our love to Mary, says Pam. Definitely, definitely, says Janet, shaking this around. <laughs> They look, they look similar to, um, you, yeah, you love products, don't you, um, pickles? Yeah, because if you do your colouring, they look more like your colour twos to me. Colour twos, yes, yeah. I, I, I definitely enjoy using them because they're quite creamy and, yes. Mm. Oh, um, Trudy's just bought four... Christmas paper pads to make a master board. Oh, and three packs of stickers. Oh, what fun, what fun. Keep a lookout in your letterbox this week, Trudy. <laughs> I don't know where the Royal Mail's been on strike. Mm. Oh, you're off now, sorry. Quick visit. Oh, I love, I'm so glad. Got to take your bets. So I do hope your little doggy is okay. Yes. Oh, mm. you take care of your little doggies too, Lisa. So nice that you could pop by. I love that. I love that. It's a real community feel, isn't it, when people pop by and we've got our replayers and the gentle listeners as well. Because <laughs> it's just not always easy to write in chat. It really isn't. It, maybe because of our eyes or maybe because... I just don't feel up to it. So <laughs> there's Peter. If is anybody able to put a link in for Peter's latest video? Uh, it's wonderful. I've already got it written down here, Peter. You're an amazing videographer. I love it. And you edit your videos. I show Ben as well. Yes, Miss Teresa, good morning. You're going to go and get coffee. Yes, yes. Mm. Oh, you've got 
If you made an advent calendar filled with washi tape, stickers and sparkly watercolours. Oh, that's Little Pickles. Did I see that on one of your videos? Such a good idea. Such a good idea. Um, there's Peter's link there. And pop your links in or ask people to put links in and links to Little Pickles. Um, because there's still time to make one, isn't there? That's a super idea. I saw someone else doing that yesterday as well. Make little boxes. Who was that? I can't remember. And then I get, I can't, it's squashed together. Then I get my little heart box out. So these are little bits and pieces of paper, magazines and painty paper. So if I've got any bits left on the the desk after we've had our session here I I make hearts and I fill up my box it's handy to have them uh, isn't that a great idea Amy isn't that a great idea so then I let's get this glue out I put on some hearts because we're building up layers so it's great to have the hearts underneath what we're doing here. And then we can, if they get co almost covered up, we can, this is lovely, this one's got some gold in it. The tiniest little scrap can become something. What's the theme of the day? Well, the theme of the day, Peter, we've had some amazing quotes, absolutely amazing quotes. My my theme is positive vibe and positive words. Just a bit of gentle creating. And I came in today with a saying shared by one of the people in the comments um, this week. Not every day is good, but there is good in every day. So that's the quote that um, I wanted to share with you that someone shared in the comments. But I also put in brackets after that, um, not every day is good, but there is good in every day. But I also said, be kind to yourself because sometimes it's hard to feel positive. Don't put yourself down because we all have days where we just can't see the positivity. So don't let that become a pressure to you either. There's Becky. You're sitting in the car waiting for Scott to finish at the dentist. I hope he's okay. Is it a checkup? Becky, let me just go, go back here. I'm getting that said. You have a new grand dog. You met him at Thanksgiving at your daughter's home. Oh, a a cavalier spaniel and he's cute as a button oh that's amazing oh good oh that's wonderful are you back yet Teresa with your coffee or are you still making it um oh you're a mod definitely definitely um little pickles yes we love to find new channels and definitely little pickles is says she is um, col a colorist that you you like to color in but you're also like um, you, an artist you design and you you make beautiful backgrounds on your pages <laughs> oh. and now I've got my little tin of words this is from Caroline Caroline is a gentle listener and replayer and it's full of positive words <laughs> so that's the stage we're at now I've got it's there's the background and I'm going to be finding some positive words yes mm. it's chilly it's chilly where you are Barbara you keep um yeah oh Jennifer you put in the link for Peter thank you thank you yes oh lovely and it's not sorry I'm just I don't want to miss any of the chat 
because it's like we're having like a little coffee break together. There's Irene. Good afternoon, Irene. So nice to see you. And sis, good morning. Come on in. Oh, a six-month-old spaniel, and it's a rescue. How wonderful. Oh, Jennifer, thank you so much. You enjoyed the Polaroid thing. Let me, oh, let me just, thank you for reminding me. I thought I would, basically, Flo felt a bit left out. And I thought we could uh, take a Polaroid picture of Flo during the stream. And if you could remind me later. Let me just put that away from the lights to develop. Evidently, you don't shake it like a Polaroid picture. <laughs> yeah, Teresa wants you to know she can't read chat this morning. Your head has been hurting. And your eyes are not working well. Now, that is just what th this will be just right for you then, Teresa, dear. You, you close those weary eyes and um I'll read the chat for you and we'll know that you're there. <laughs> she did. She did pose, didn't she? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, she loves having her photograph taken. And so does Fred. I mean, is there a little bit of competition between them? Mm. Oh, and you're going to tell the story in your next video. Oh, Jean, Jean's been doing glue booking, haven't you? Jean, do pop your link in. Now, oh, I know what I was going to show you. I'm, 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 oh, there we are. I'm like a woman obsessed. I, I absolutely love my A, B, C, D, E. I didn't do it yesterday, but you will, if you came here on a Sunday afternoon, you would see me with my feet up watching a replay one of our lovely friends online and I would be doing this in my ransom letter box <laughs> oh that's it well done you're saying yep yeah, yep yeah. you're popped over to little pickles yes put in other people's channels and pop in your own channels too or ask the mods to pop your channels in please do mm. Oh. oh, oh, that's sweet. Oh, that's sweet. They're so lovely and loving animals, aren't they, Brenda? They really are. They really are. Oh, Stephanie says she thinks she's going to do her first themed glue book Christmas. Never, You've never done a theme before. That's wonderful. Yeah, yeah. And, and it is quite nice to have themes. Also, I enjoy collecting for a theme as well. The great thing about doing a Christmas journal is that you can, you don't have to finish it this Christmas. Don't put pressure on yourself because you can finish it next year. So there's no, no pressure. Yeah. I've changed it around a little bit. Well, I didn't do that, Peter. Flo is edging her way nearer to the camera. It'll come the day when you'll tune into a live and it will just be Flo. I mean, I'm just saying. <laughs> There's Roy. Don't worry. No, don't worry. You got a late pass, didn't you? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, Roy, I loved your sewing, your, your little bags. I think, oh, your relatives and friends that received the bags must, oh, must love them. Oh, so I collect letters and I put them in, in here. And I thought it would be nice to spell out a word to put on our postcard. I've got all my tin of positive words, but what word would you like to see on here? Um, let me know and I will spell it out. 
I know this is going to go flying at one stage. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Isn't it amazing? The flash is built into the film. It's amazing technology, the Polaroid. <laughs> hmm. Any positive words that you'd like me to spell out with my ransom letters? On this one, I've spelt out comfort. And then I've got, oh, I've got joy here. That can go on. That's maybe a bit big. And should I tip them out? Tip them out, Chad. Oh, shine. That's a lovely one. Shine. I like a ripped edge as well. Hmm. Kai, oh, lovely. I thought we'd come up with some because if I don't use them on this one, I will use them on another one. Kindness and hopeful. How wonderful. How wonderful. Thank you. Hopeful. Oh, yeah. Roy, so nice. Roy just popped his head round. That's so nice. Round the door saying, hi, got a dash, but hi. I love that. Mm. Yes, you then um, the late. Yes, the ones we had in the 70s, I'll bring one. I'll bring that down another day. It doesn't work. But you had flash cubes that went round. This one has an inbuilt flash. The technology of the 80s. Mm. Did you, Stephanie? Yeah, your first camera ever. Oh, I know. My, uh, my, one of my first cameras, yes, yes, was a Polaroid. Oh, I loved it. The one with the red button. <laughs> the 1970s. Yes, that's how old I am. <laughs> Don't know where my glue stick is, so I'll just use this. I'm putting on here because I did type out some words i'm putting you are enough on there oh and you want me to write out mm, the words kindness that's a long word let's choose some little ones h-i-j-k k-i-m I love this. Oh, it, oh. M D. You don't have to look to. They can all be different kind. N sizes. N E. I love this. That's an F. I got in the wrong one. E and two S's. S. And S. I love it. I love you. I love I love using them as well. There's Penny. Good morning, Penny. So nice to see you. I'm gonna put that right on the floor because that might fall off the bin. Be careful. And here's lovely Marty. How nice to see you, Marty. <laughs> Friendship. Thank you. If I'm missing any. I'm missing any, let me know. Oh, Jean's saying she loves Amy's style. Yes, we found we found Amy this week, didn't we? Yes, that's some um, doki doki forest. <laughs> and don't worry if it goes over the hearts because you can always put more in. It's just nice to have something in the background. And if you're making this for a specific person, Oh, I know why I started making these. Because I started off, there was a person and I know she knew she loved words. And I was making her a postcard. That's how it started off. And I filled it with words. And I thought, do you know, I'd like to make more of those. A little bits of positivity going in the post as well because it's not just the person who receives it it's the person that um that it, it's all it, it's the post office and the postman or the mailman man, people yeah kindness there you go then they're, they're not very neatly 
cut either. So there we are. And if it goes, oh, you've just got back from the gym. You went early. I know Penny on your video. Penny has a channel, a channel, and I watch her live on a Thursday. And very gentle to be with. And there's lovely Rebecca who will be going to your stream in a minute. Mm. Isn't it? And it's amazing, Amy, how many words you can fit in a small tin like that. So beautifully decorated by Caroline. So, yeah, you can adapt it because this person I made the postcard for, I put a rainbow on because I knew she liked rainbows. So you can add some stickers or pictures as well. I'm putting shine there. It's very roughly cut, but I think that adds to the... Because we're going to come in with doodling. And we're also going to come round. I, you can do faux stitching. I've done some, I've put two together because it's a bit wobbly otherwise. I, I put two together. And I, I, I find doodling such fun. Oh, sorry, Flo. Flo's so busy. Can you see here? She's very messy. I don't know whether anybody else is like this. I certainly am. But all around her feet, she's got her bits she's been collecting for her Christmas journal there. I'm going to put the words. So I've got kindness there. And I will add friendship and hopeful. I might have to type those out. I can do that. I have put discover on there. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, so nice to see you, Marty. Do come in. And if you don't ever feel like um, getting the trolley and taking the trolley round, there's no pressure. <laughs> oh, I like to put art on my, or create maybe. Let's see what we've got. Oh, somebody said friendship. Hold on. I had friendship and then it pinged. Do you know what I've got in the tin here? I call create with Rebecca. I don't know why. I call you Rebecca and I've got Rebecca in my tin. <laughs> oh dear. I just saw friendship and then it pinged. Well, that's funny. I will find it. We'll type it out. Don't worry. Oh, lovely. Oh, community. I love that. That was at the top of a page. It's tiny. I'm going to put that in as well. Lovely. So, oh, didn't know where to dip my glue there. And I'm going to put it over some of these as well, just to tie it all together. No right or wrong. <laughs> oh, I'm missing. I'm missing the chat because I'm just getting so carried away. Oh. Let me just come back up or down now because I've pressed it wrong. I hope I haven't chucked anyone out. That's my fear when I touch this. Mm. Oh, that's with, oh, goodness. I, oh, there's, what did I do? Yeah, Brenda, it's a good idea. Mm. Yeah, all you need to do, a little tray and some scissors. It's wonderful. Or when you're harvesting magazines and you can have, have a, a plastic wallet of big words as well. But I just, yes, yes. I will find that friendship one later. But um, I think you get, I think you get the general idea. <laughs> And it's not, it's not dry enough for me to come in with the doodles. But what I do to build, just to build up these layers here, I have, sometimes you can get, you have deli paper and you can do a whole deli paper of stamping. So you've got them in. And what I did is I, 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 I got my little homemade stamp here of joy and stamped joy 
on painty deli paper. So I'm just going to stick that on as well, just because I can. Hmm. Oh, girls going, oh, another, another injection. I missed that guy, dear. Oh, for your sore knee. Oh, yes. Yes, we do hope it works and that it's not too sore when you have that injection. Yes, yes. Thank you, Jean, for keeping me up to date with what's going on in chat. If I do miss anything important like that, do let me know. Yes. Laurie, Laurie Pay Girlie, hi, so nice to see you. <laughs> oh, there we are. So, yes, it's got just lots of words, and I can add other words. Hopeful and friendship, type them out. So, just going to push that to one side there. The desk is looking delicious, isn't it, with all its bits and pieces. And then what I do is then I pile everything up. <laughs> do you do that? Oh. I'm going to come in maybe with another heart because we can't see the heart. So I've just put those over there, but I can do that later. I'm going to add a candle because that shows the person that we're really thinking about them and I'm also going to come in with when it's dry just to build up the texture I'm going to come in with some stamping and some ink and then I'm going to doodle <laughs> I get my black pen and I doodle and then I do go over it with the PVA or Mod Podge later and then that that's a postcard ready to send through the post. <laughs> Would you like to put some numbers in and I will send this through the post? <laughs> and I've got another one here that I can send as well. So, yes, pop a number in. Pop a number in for yourself. And pop another number in for other people as well. Please do. <laughs> and I can read the chat. Mm. You, you yes oh okay oh thank you um little doodles yes yeah little pickle little doodles <laughs> little doodles little pickles you started to do more doodling oh that's lovely lovely oh oh little pickles put in penny pudges um penny pudges yeah, oh, do, please do share links and everything like that. There's the numbers. My chat keeps freezing. I hope I don't keep freezing. Oh, Amber, so nice to see you. Come on in. So nice to see you. And I do a little draw for the, for the people that are on the replay as well, because I don't want them to miss out, because they, they are in the replayers. Um, let me know in the comments as well and lots of you do too it's lovely we've had some amazing i've got some amazing things to read out from the comments as well positive quotes and things like that Bess here <laughs> you popped a number in for yourself and for some other people did Teresa get to put a number in can is someone able to put um a number in for for Teresa, because her eyes aren't working too well today. Jasper, I saw you live on um, on Kathy C's channel. It was lovely. You were sharing all your your finds. Ah, uh, oh, there we are. Kerr, hi, Kerr. So, my take on the lake is Kerr welcome welcome in and she's saying well done to all the messy crafters that admit that they're messy i know <laughs> more numbers than in a bingo hall says peter <laughs> oh shall i is that it now shall i do random.org <laughs> it's not too late i haven't i'm fiddling here so pop a number in it's just a little draw between one and a hundred and I will send off the postcard to you. Right, let me see. 
and you never know, it might get there. <laughs> Random number generator. Here we are. Here we are. Between one and a hundred. Are we all? Are we set? Mm. Becky Waters comes in. Messy is not bad. It's a process. Yes, if we didn't have all this mess on our desk, we wouldn't be able to make scrummy backgrounds and postcards and things like that. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, it's 1.48 a.m. Tuesday morning. Yeah, must get some shut eye. You sleep tight, Peter. I'm so glad that you popped in and people will be following your link to your lovely video. Hmm. Jen, Jennifer's roaring up the fireplace. Yes, yeah, it's getting cold, is it? There's Varika. Good morning, Varika. So nice to see you. So nice to see you. 56. Who had number 56 on or nearest under? And I'm going to generate another number here for the... Between one and... 59 for the people that were in the comments and generate has come up with the same number no between 1 and 59 the number is 10 Ooh, what am I like <laughs> what am I like there we are oh Mariah so nice to see you come on in come on in so nice to see you Ruth Lamb oh I should be sending a postcard to Chile, Nova Scotia. And who was on the um, comments? Barbara, our very own chicken pot pie. <laughs> Barbara. So let me write Barbara there. I will be, that's from the comments. I shall be sending a postcard to Barbara too. <laughs> oh. Marty on the nose. Oh, was Ruth on the nose? Was there two, dear? Or was that? I get so confused. It's Marty right on the nose, not Ruth. No, Marty was first. Oh, hold on. Were there two people who had 56? Because I've got, I can send, that doesn't matter. I can send one to Marty. Well, because I, I love making them. <laughs> Oh dear, that's lovely. I sure Marty and Ruth had 56. I am I right or am I right? Paper Hoarders loves that quote. Oh, um, did did you say a quote? It's not a mess, it's a process. Absolutely, we love that. It's not I'm gonna write that down. It's not a mess. It's a process and good morning Becky Becky W have you got the children off to school <laughs> oh there we are Marty had 56 and Ruth had 56 well I've got a post I've written them down I've I've got one for Marty one for Ruth and one for Barbara I'm loving that I shall doodle on this one when it's dry that's later <laughs> oh lovely Absolutely lovely. We've got another one in the making here. So this is perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> Mariah, I'm loving all the new stencils that you got out. I, the, I was watching Devon use, use her stencil with the truck and you've got our Mariah. Um, Miriam has done some nutcrackers. Oh, it's lovely. Absolutely lovely. How's our Polaroid picture turning out? Let's have a look. Oh, oh, not yet. It's not developed quite yet. They take a while. They take a while. I'll pop it there. Remind me at the end. <laughs> Story of your life, mess and process. I know, Kerr, I know, I know. You have to pop off. Oh, that's um, Amy, yes. Your youngest is at school. Just called. Oh, hold on. Just called for you to pick up. I do hope everything's okay. Oh, feeling, yeah. Oh, bless him. Bless him. That's, yeah. Oh, 
You take care, Amy, and it's so nice that you came in to chat for the first time. Yeah, you you take care. I'm pushing, just making myself some room here. Mm. Yeah, thank you, everybody. Oh, Rhonda, did I say good morning to you, Rhonda? Or were we in the midst of um, doing all the... Did I say good morning to you? Just to... Oh, no, I can do that later. Right, I think I'm going to get... Let's have a snack, shall we? Oh, did you see him? He licked his lips and moved. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You take care. Oh, I see. Number 10 was from the number 10 was from the comments. Um, my list of comments. But we don't want there to be any disappointment and confusion. I'm Cheryl. So I am going to be sending you something in the post too, because we don't like any confusion. <laughs> Don't you worry, Mrs. Teapot time. Yes, Cheryl, there will be a postcard winging its way to you too. <laughs> Melissa, good morning. So nice to see you. Yes. Oh, we're, we're, that's it. Um, Beth, we'll sort that. We can always sort it. Beth's another one you love to send. Happy now. I didn't change my trousers. These are my dog walking trousers. They're like comfy pajamas for me. They were Sam's when he was a teenager, and like fleecy. <laughs> oh, dear, and probably a bit muddy around the edges. Oh, dear. I should have, you know, I've just not dressed for the occasion. <laughs> nice and comfy, though. Oh, Brenda, your dog's heard the word snack. <laughs> there he is, perked up. Oh, they recognise it, don't they? And Freddie recognises the timing of the stream as well. Oh, let's have a let's have a hot beverage. Or if you're in Florida, or, or you're in Australia where it's spring, coming into early summer, you might not want a hot beverage. <laughs> Our lovely worldwide community, I love it. Mm. And I'm going to let's. Oh, there we are. How did Freddie get his name? Well, we, yes, nothing, yeah, I just liked the name. They wanted to call him Rodney from Only Fools and Horses, Rodders. I don't know whether any of you know that. I was desperate. They said, oh, no, don't call him Rodney. I really don't call him Rodney. So even before Sam, Sam was down in Brighton with friends, and um, I, 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 I quickly named him Freddie so, he, so Rodney wouldn't stick. <laughs> that was the first day on the way home in the car. Oh, yeah, Stephanie says her doggy only needs to hear the um, treat thing and she's there. Yeah. God, oh, Trudy, we love Only Fools and Horses. We've watched it so many times. I think we used it, not the videos. I think we used to have the DVD set. I don't know whether it's on UK Gold or something like that. Hmm. Oh, you're using the, Melissa's using the big phone to type and you're watching on the little phone. That's a good idea, Melissa. Yeah. Mm. Right, come on then. Oh, you're not going to get down. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, it's like that, is it? You're not going to get down. These treats are from Trudy. Trudy really sent you these ones. They're dinky, aren't they? Aren't they lovely? He likes these. He can have quite a few. Hmm. You can have some at the end. Just remind me, Freddie. I think you deserve them. Don't you? Hmm. Enough? Hmm. Lovely. Ah. <laughs> oh. There we are. Let's lean right over there. <laughs> oh, he loves his treat, doesn't he? Oh, his name's Ryder. Oh, that's lovely. That's a lovely name. <laughs> yes, 
Yes, Brenda. Um, Mary said last night she because I did the faux Polaroid pictures again. Something very simple. But Mary's doing an ATC Polaroid swap, isn't she? So do contact Mary if you want to be part of that. I think you just you just have to make three ATCs and you have one partner. That's nice, isn't it? <laughs> I can't I can't get this off. Oh, Roy's back. <laughs> oh yes, if I'm missing anyone, let me know. Because I I'm one of those people I don't like to miss out on what's going on. <laughs> I can't open this. Oh, there we are. I made some jam tarts with the leftover pastry from making a pumpkin pie. Sam had made a pumpkin pie before, but I made my first pumpkin pie. I think the secret with a pumpkin pie is to take it out at the right time. Not too, I think mine was in too long, but we enjoyed it. Your, oh yes, your grand dog is called Cabri. Oh yes, that's a fantastic name. Chocolate Lab called Cabri. That is perfect. Because we all know that Cabri's chocolate is actually the best. <laughs> Is that controversial? Might be, might not. But it is, it is. <laughs> oh, dear. Yes, the Queen of Hearts, she made some tarts. <laughs> Where's the milk? Oh, here. I, I broke the milk jug. It's from Channel Islands. Got another picture on there. I'm still going to use it, though, because I love it. 1950s. I think it's from... Channel Islands, Guernsey or Jersey pottery. Let's put that there. There we are. Let's put my tea there. That's the old tea. Mug of the day. It's looking beginning to look a bit Christmassy and cold weathery, isn't it? <laughs> what was I going to do? Yes. Let's. Where's the candle? You know when you get to that stage when you can't. Oh. Right in front of me. <laughs> There's Kathy. Good morning, Kathy. We loved your stream with Jasper. That was really lovely. Really lovely. Mm. There we are. Right. And um, what am I doing? What am I doing? Let's light a candle first, and then I've got all these lovely quotes to share with you. I want to light a candle because people have been sharing with me in the comments and on messages. It, it really is a hard time for people with, with their health and um, and also. Facing loss and so let's you know who we're keeping in our heart, your hearts, and who and I'm mentioning people too. And we're particularly thinking of Melissa. Melissa, I'm I'm Mary. I mean Mary. We're thinking of you as well, Melissa. But we're keeping in mind Mary today, who's undergoing eye surgery and also an extra special thought for people that are just feeling weary. But blow the candle out. But as I always say, it doesn't mean to say that we're going to stop thinking of people. Let me just catch up with what's we said. Pom pom, yes, that's it. Yes, yes. Love to Emerson and Jackson. I do hope they're getting better. And oh, you you can you're getting distressed black soot from the fireplace. Jen's good idea. Good idea. That's all charcoal is as well, isn't it? Mm. 
what's the temperature? I think it's, I, oh, sure. Should we look up temperature London? I'd have to look it up because I'm not sure. It, I had my coat on and a scarf. Let's say it's coat weather. And that, yes, it's coat weather, um, Beth. <laughs> I've got the heating on as well <laughs> today, yeah. Mm. Tell me what the knife test is, Gail, just in case. It's a little bit like making a lemon pie. If it cracks, you know you've overdone it because I think if it's not quite firm, you take it out because it continues to cook. Yeah. Tips and tricks, because I'm definitely going to make it next year. Ben wasn't keen. Mm. Trudy's got a cappuccino and Jaffa cakes. Wow. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy. We love a Jaffa cake. <laughs> Let me just scroll down. Mm. Let me scroll down. The temp in Croydon is 49. Um, Fahrenheit, nine, nine. Oh, nine. Oh, isn't that funny? I thought it was about 15. See, it just shows what I know. Nine. Yes, it's, it was quite pleasant. <laughs> quite pleasant, really. Just if you've just got a coat, you just have to wear one wears one's coat. Yes. A bit nippy then. Not really, Beth, if you've got your coat on, but if you're, if you're used to, um, if you're used to lun, if you're used to Florida, you would find it really chilly. Now, I did show on my one of my little videos that I, out of the big matchbox, I've made a journal to send someone. And these are the big matches. And what I've started to do is make little banners with the match. Now, Kat messaged me and said, oh, it would be nice to use the matches that, um, that from the stream it's like a connection um but isn't that interesting? I said no way cat I literally just did that this week for the first time great minds think alike <laughs> oh Gail yeah Janet you take a clean table knife when you think it's done you put the knife down through the center if it comes out clean the pie is done okay thank you I will do that a little bit our Victoria sponge is the same, definitely. Mm. Take the, do you jiggle or does the pudding have to jiggle? You, you, you're jiggling the pudding. No, I know what you mean, Roy. Thank you. It still has, yes. See, that's what I didn't have the confidence to do. I left it in too long. So it didn't look brilliant, but really, my family are used to that. Mm. <laughs> Uh, so let yes what what word am I going to put on this week have we got one word I'm going to put hopeful hope hopeful on this and I will be sending these out in happy mail or putting them in my journal. So it just in the white pen, oh, I just make a little banner. So it's just a little connection there. Mm. So let me read out some of the quotes that people sent me in comments. Because all these lots of notes. <laughs> oh dear. So this was this from someone in comments. Mm. Oh, um, Lynn, that would be so lovely. Thank you. I do. But Lynn, the thing is, um, it, postage costs a lot of money. So we, I tend to, um, I tend to send uh, light things and quite not too thick. And yeah, yeah. You, you love fairies too, Lynn. Oh, how lovely. I always love areas <laughs> I was in the woods up in the woods yesterday and where the roots meet and they there's a little bath I always used to call those fairy baths when I was a little girl mm. and Brenda's going to make a mincemeat pie oh yes yes 
And I know um, Becky made a mince meat pie. I thought that was just a British thing. Yeah. Yeah. So over here, it might be homemade mince pies next week. You always have that conversation. The British people in the chat will be, will, is that right? You'll say, or you talk to anybody or the person at the checkout. Have you had your first mince pie yet? Oh, I haven't had one yet. <laughs> I bought some the other day. <laughs> it's been a bit iffy, the post in, um, in, in, yeah, there have been strikes in November. I hope it's going to be okay. Yeah. Mm. You're making Jim a mince meat pie. Mince meat for um, Penny. Mince meat for anyone who doesn't know is raisins and a vegetable suet. Or, or, or it doesn't have to be vegetable, but I have vegetable suet, which is a fat. And lots of grated apple and, and spices. Mm, and it's delicious. And it for us for Christmas that we have small mince pies. It, it's a double crust pie, and yeah, that's our thing. Mm. Oh, and Roy likes mince meat, isn't it? Some Americans depends on your heritage, I suppose. Mm. Mm. Your mother used to always make mince meat pies for the holidays, but she made it with real shredded venison. Oh, right, okay. Yes, ours is, ours is, um, yes. Mm. Oh, lovely. So that's lovely, Lynn. Thank you so much. <laughs> that's so kind of you. Thank you. Mm. <laughs> mm. But it has no meat. But we call it mince meat. Is it? I don't know why. I think the with the English language, we just like to confuse things there. I know. Oh, and it has sugar. So it has the sugar and the sugar from sugar and the sugar from the dried fruit, which is like raisins and sultanas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One of your great grandmothers came from England in the 1880s. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, I think you did mention that because you said you'd been saying yes to visit. Yeah. Mm. Because in the olden days, it was always made with meat. Mm. True, true. Yeah, I know. It's very confusing. The English language is very confusing. And you see, Jasper's never heard of mince meat pie, or as you can have them like in a big pie, but we call them mince pies because they're small. I'm going to put this over here, and I will chomp away at those um, when I'm listening to Rebecca. I don't want to talk with my mouth full. <laughs> you have some English ancestors in your lineage, <laughs> Roy. Yes, I love raisins too. I think raisins, I like chocolate raisins. Hi, Shannon. So nice to see you. So nice to see you. You're just coming in at the right time. I'm going to read out the quotes and these have come from, so they're not written lightly. I haven't got them from Google. They're written from people in our community. So they really mean something. Not every day is good but there is good in every day. And someone else wrote, it is far better to light a candle than curse the darkness. So, yeah, and, and how lovely Mrs. Pickle, Miss Pickles came in and said, you don't need to be great and skilled at art to create and i've written it's because i've written it down in my shorthand to create art creative mm, oh, hold on i wrote it down miss pickles wrong if, if you could send it me the gist is you don't have to be great and skilled to do art to create art creatively is for everyone <laughs> Oh dear, I've written it down a bit wrong. And then we had another quote. A flower does not compete with the next flower. It just blooms. So it's wonderful. 
wonderful. <laughs> wonderful to have these different quotes all mean different things to different people at different times. Kelly loves mince meat pie. Mmm. Mince meat pie and custard. Oh, cool. Goodness me. <laughs> oh, lovely. Shall we do some prompts? Hmm. I haven't got a Blondel to show share with you this week, but I'm percolating one, shall I say. Hmm. Oh, you've eaten it all your life, Brenda. Yes. Your grandfather came from Wales. Oh, right. And that's where your family got it. And, and yeah. You've done it with and without dried roast beef. Oh, well, I never. Gosh, that's amazing. I've never had it made like that or heard of it. Mm. Yes, it is, Becky. It is. But in, in, in some people's recipes that are passed down from hundreds of years ago, it might have meat in it. Gosh, it had shredded animal fat in, maybe. Yeah. Ha Good afternoon, Mrs. Gigi. We are debating the the great British mince pie here and I and because our lovely Mrs Gigi spent a lot of time in England you would have your family would have had mince pies <laughs> oh. oh um are you in any of the Facebook groups Lynn dear or on Instagram because then then we can message one another three four five six oh Rhonda you're popping to work now I'm so glad that you can spend this little bit of time time with us yeah thank you you starting your day with us starting your week I appreciate that you take care Rhonda have a good day and a, a good week hope you get a chance to do a bit of creating too after work maybe yeah take care Rhonda mm. um your mum English brittle oh how nice is that like toffee toffee brittle mm. that sounds yummy mm. <laughs> Mrs Gigi is saying hi to everyone. Good afternoon, Mrs Gigi. Let's just get this out here. There we are. I've just sewed my page in my magazine book that I'm using. What did I do last week? We did this one and I had such fun in the evenings. I, I We had so many quotes. I had to make a little bookmark to write more of them down. And this is where I put the first matchstick and it said, keep going. It's wonderful. So I've got a record of all these lovely quotes. Pam, good morning. So nice to see you. Becky is mostly English and, and, and Danish. Yeah, and a, a tiny thread of Cherokee. How wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful to know. Oh, look, did I show you this? This is one in the back of my book. Trudy coloured that for me. Gaga for gluing and sent me that. Isn't that wonderful? Right. What was that? Where is the blank page? Oh, I just sewed the page ready. Oh, then most, most of the children have gone to school. You've had a busy morning already, haven't you? Hopefully you can relax and do some sewing very soon. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is, in one of Jean's blue books, was it Jean, Bainey, did I get this idea from you? One of your pages had a swirly edge. Was it you, Jean? I should have written it for you. See, if you don't write it down, you don't remember, Shanna. Maybe people just the same, I know. So I've got a curly edged page here. So when you do the next page, you can already see that page. 
Am I explaining that right? Was it you, Jean? Yes. I can put a link. Or Jean, if you can, if you're um if you're able, you could put a link in. Or if not, I can put a link down below. And when when you see that, I thought, oh, I love that. So I'm going to create on this page this week and next week. So you have to bear in mind what you're going to see or peek through. I'm going to use this bit to make like a little pocket here. So I'm going to stick that on and then we can create. <laughs> You've tried them both ways, Brenda. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and it adds a little bit of protein. I'm going to look that up. Yeah, that's really interesting. Yes. They probably were nutritious. Probably that's what they used to go and work out in the fields and gave them energy. Mm. You're six years old at home. Oh, it's not well. Oh, there's a lot of holes. And hope he's okay. Yeah. Is that the one that had the birthday? Um, Pam, I want to get, oh, Pam, um, do leave a link or someone leave a link for Pam's channel. I want to get back to Pam because I haven't seen your Friday so yet. Are you showing the dungarees? Or as you like to call them, overalls. <laughs> overalls for us are more what mechanics wear, like with the sleeves all in. <laughs> We have different names, don't we, here? You're all chilly, Kelly. Oh, yeah. You you have a nice warm drink, Kelly, and warm up. Mm. Healing energy. Yes. Yes, Gail. And to you as well, Gail. Mm. Positive vibes for Roy. Is there something happening with our Roy up there that I've missed? Mm. Oh, you're running. Oh, Go for a CT scan. Okay. Well, Roy, I bet you've gone yet and you've got to go into the city for that. Let me just write that down so I remember. I love all this writing down. Um, malarkey, there you go. Yes. Hmm. You take care, Roy. Yes, yeah. Yes. I'm glad I see because you're writing in it, it prompts me as well. Yes, you take care, Roy. So that's that's it's got a pocket, this page, and it, it's shorter. <laughs> Let's have a prompt without further ado. Oh, I love this, this one. It says, give yourself a gold star is prompt number one. Give yourself a gold star. You can do these in any order. Um, let me see. Somewhere. How like now? These are random. I don't know what's coming, but I did because it's Christmas. Get my. I made it out of a cork. This out. So I. Even though it's good, I'm going to have some gold stars in the background and later on I can come and do some, yeah, I can do some, I'm going to put an apron on. Pam, you didn't remind me to put an apron on. <laughs> You're busy, I know, I know. But to look after myself. Yes, I'd love to see if anyone pops a link in for Pam's because... She does, does Friday so, as does Becky and Kathy. So do throw lots of links in. I'm going to roll up my sleeves because I really mean business. <laughs> now, use what you have. I have silver, bronze or copper. So that's I'm going to use. Give yourself a gold star. I love that. That's nice and positive. You deserve it. You give yourself a gold star and whatever, whatever that means to you. Mm. I know I don't want to dip that in the paint, do I? Wouldn't matter about the dog walking trousers that I've got on. 
Oh, Jasper says she needs an apron. She tried gluing one together. Oh, yes, because you're not... You were saying on Kathy's channel, this is bronze, not gold, but um, hey-ho. You, your mum has a sing sewing machine that you can use, but you're just getting used to make, using it. I love this. What? I'm going to give the person that I send this postcard to a gold, a, a bronze star. <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's the link to Jean, Jean's glue book, and she'd done this page. So the flip throughs, was, was that part of Christina's hashtag flip through Friday, or were you flipping through because that's what you do when you come to the end of a journal? Oh, I've got lots of paint here, so I'm not going to waste it. Give yourself a gold star, or in my case, is, did I use the copper or the bronze? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it's a shiny star anyway. Kathy D, good morning. So nice to see you. Come on in. You sewing today? You're doing your lovely quilting. I love your your Christmas quilts, they're gorgeous. And here's Kat, come in, Kat. Happy Monday to you, so nice to see you. <laughs> oh, I was telling everybody, Kat, that um, great minds think alike, that you said, why don't you use the matchsticks? And I said, no way. <laughs> I just literally done that, I love it. Oh dear, I'm doing so many, it just gives it depth if you continue to print with it and if you've just got the ghost of it. Mm. Thank you, Julia. I think we all deserve a gold star. There's Linda. Oh, why well, stop at one? <laughs> Pop in a bunch. Linda, so nice to see you. And this reminds me, as Linda's coming in, and to everybody in the chat and the gentle listeners and the replayers, thank you so much. Your comments are so wonderful and so encouraging. Thank you. I I do appreciate them so much. Yeah, yeah. Am I missing anything? I don't want to miss anybody. Yeah. Oh, oh, Jasper. Oh, Jasper. Oh, I miss it. Yeah, I am missing something. Mm. You really miss your mum. Oh, you lost her during COVID. Oh, I am so sorry. Yeah, mm, no. Yeah, you're still having a hard time, and yeah, you you need to take your time with these things, Jasper. It's yeah, there's no set pattern, is there, for these things? Yeah, yeah. Let me let's just light a candle for Jasper and for anybody who's lost somebody because. Seriously, it doesn't matter. Um, I don't think I can make a banner out of that one. Maybe something else. Um, it doesn't matter if it was recently or in the... Those people always stay with us. And, and our grief is a journey. It really is. It's not an easy journey. It certainly isn't. There we are. I'm going to light that and we're going to have a little moment of silence. I'm going to blow that out. Mm. 
Yeah, Teresa, you understand. Yes, yes. And there's lots of people that share with me. And yeah, definitely. Let's, let's, let's not waste any of this paint. Where can we squash it? Oh, I know what I can do with that leftover paint. Mm. Where are, where's the, oh, here, a paint scraper, just an old card. Yeah, yeah. Let's just go like that. Ooh, lovely. And on next week's page, we'll just carry that through and just put that there. If you've just come in, I've just cut my page to be wavy. This week's wavy with a little pocket. So these pages might tie in a bit. There you go. And I'm trying not to get paint all over myself. <laughs> oh. Yes, Kerr, definitely. Mm. I know, I know. It's so true, so true. For anybody that we lose, yes. Mm. Mm. Becky W, I know, I know. Mm. Jennifer, true. That is a bright candle. Mm, definitely. Mm. Cheryl says love to all those. Yes, yes. Yeah. Thank you, Cheryl, and everybody. Mm, yeah. Mm. Tears, Brenda. It's hard during the, the holiday season and we honour that. Yes, we definitely do. Mm. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Yeah, thank you, Patty. Yeah, what lovely... We're lovely and supportive for one another in our creativity. Hmm. I'm going to pull another prompt. Oh, how interesting. I've got this copper going on. It should be gold star, but we use what we have. I could give a gold outline when that's finished. I've got a gold pen. So when that's finished, I could go around it in gold. Oh, lovely doodling. Red circles. Really? Red circles, yes, let's go for it. Red circles, this is fun, it's play. It's only a bit of paper. Um, if we don't like it, we can always cover it up with gesso. Let's play and experiment, shall we? Does red go with this coppery? There we are. When I pick, if you don't like that, you choose your own color. This red's not working. I need something to poke down. It's got all gooped up. There you go. And let's clean that. Mm. There we are. There. So what's on everybody's creative space? I know a lot of you. This really, this pet, this red does not want to work. It's a little bit gloopy. It says, I came from Poundland and it's quite a long time ago and I'm feeling quite gloopy. Right, let's see if this one works. And I've always got watercolour. This doesn't work, but I, I just fancied doing some printing. Hmm. Draw circles. Oh, yes. Oh, I could. Ooh. I've got this. I will do that as well. Oh, yes, because that's fun. I can do swirls. I'm going to do circles and swirls because I have. Our lovely Laura sent me this gelato, a red one, in the post. So I've got that. I shall do some swirls. I save little circles and bit. Yes. I've got this tiny little, do you, I bet you do that. You always save packaging. I had another thing. I'm going to do this and then I'm going to do some swirls. Mm. Was that circles? Circles. Yes, circles. I'm loving that. Wonderful. Thank 
Thank you, Linda, <laughs> for reminding me. Oh, yes, I will. Yes, Brenda. We always light the candle, don't we? Definitely, Brenda. Definitely. Because it is, yeah. Mm. Oh, darling, we're keeping you company. How wonderful. How wonderful that we're with you when you're decorating the Christmas tree. This is for you, Brenda. And when I light the candle, Brenda, at other times, I, oh, I'm putting that there, aren't I? Um, I do think of you. I really do. When I light the candle on videos or on the lives, yeah, you're often in my heart, Brenda. Mm. Yeah, yeah. There we are. There we are, Brenda. Mm. Let's have a little bit of quiet as well. Hmm. Here's a bright candle, Jennifer. Thank you for pointing that out. Definitely. Definitely. It shines bright, doesn't it? Hmm. Hmm. Gosh. This is fun. <laughs> hmm. It's lovely that we've got, even if you don't feel up to doing any creating yourself, as I say this most weeks, it's just as creative to watch and think and ponder about creativity. Let's scrape some paint, shall we? <laughs> Get my paint scrapey book out. So we don't waste any. I think we... Having read, where did I put the card? I put it back in the right place. Goodness me. We need a lot of red at this time of year. There we are. Oh, gosh. Right, that'll have to dry. Put that somewhere to dry. And I have got my lovely Barbara Every book here. As well, I can scrape paint in here. Oh, Penny, take care, take care. Is that which, which Penny I've got? Penny from Florida and Penny, oh, Penny Parge, by all. Hope to see you. Take care. And if not, I'll see you on Thursday during your live. Yes. Take good care. You must be tired after being going to the gym. And Barbara, this is a wonderful junk journal from Barbara Every, and I'm using using it as a paint scrapey book. And I don't know. And then it's going to go on another journal, and I'm not quite sure what that journey is yet. Let's put that over there. Should we just check while I remember the Polaroid picture of Flo? Oh. It's very fuzzy, but it is flow. It's quite mystical, isn't it? Mm. That's right, Linda. Thank you for putting the prompts in. <laughs> Thank you. That yes, yes, Cheryl. Yes. Um, give yourself a gold star because you deserve it in red circles. Yes, so it's definitely flow, but it's miss. It's mm. mystical. Who was telling me in the comments that, um, ooh, lovely, that they had somewhat, I think, was it Penny Hodge in the comments, um, that they had some art given to them and it was a Polaroid picture and then the person painted and enhanced that. Isn't that wonderful? I need to write that idea down. Or do you think it'll come to me at the right time? Because, wow, 
I'd love to do that. I'm doing circles swirly with my. So that might be another thing. Is someone messaging me that? No, they're not. It's um, that idea. I'm writing everything down at the moment because it feels the right thing to do. Loving that. Some coming off the page. Yes, it's a hot mess, but... It's a beautiful background for our positive quotes. Mm. <laughs> Let's have another prompt, shall we? I don't want to get my elbow in this. <laughs> mm. El ancient Celtic peoples revered red and green coloured holly plants for being evergreen and believed holly was meant to keep earth beautiful during the dead so amazing I, I found some holly yesterday in the woods and it does I love the evergreen and the yew trees definitely gal thank you for sharing that yes they've been gathering it and bringing it in for years haven't they mm. our different customs that we have yes for our wind festivals and Christmas mm. Mm. Let's have another prompt, shall we? No. When I ask the um, chat for, oh, how amazing. When I asked the chat for prompts a while back and I wrote them down, someone said to me, put ransom letters in because they knew that I love my ransom letters. That is wonderful. So I can get my box of ransom letters out again. What um, what fun. I can't stick them on yet because I need, I need to let that dry. Right. I We've already had some. What word would you like me to put on this with my ransom letters? Oh, what fun. Someone said that to me because they know I love ransom letters. And you can out of a magazine or if you don't you can just write something have you come up with something else that netty hi so nice to see you <laughs> oh come on in netty are you feeling any better today because i know you haven't been well and because your daughter was cooking for you yesterday wasn't she what word shall we write can you give me something to write on here obviously i'm going to have so many because i've got a tuck pocket here i can make up lots of tags and extra papers to put down all these wonderful positive sayings that we've come up with karen thank you let me write i don't need to write it down because i'll have it here karen see well, it can be quite big ones, A. Eh? Yes, R. Oh, everyone's a winner, and I always forget. Thank you. Oh, and cherish. Oh, lovely. We can we can have more than one thing, Cheryl. Caring. I have to write that down because of the thread. Yes, cherish. Thank you. Oh, lovely. Embrace. Oh, wonderful. I might not do that right now. This light. <laughs> It's my desk I want to um, illuminate, not my face. Um, is that illuminating the desk significantly? I don't know. Um, embrace, a oh, wonderful and cherish. Thank you. I will come back and use all those words with my, um, get this light sorted out next week. Um, Excuse me, doing a little bit of housework here. Um, right, so care. What, what was the. Your word, or could you remind me again what word I was spelling out? Um, oh, and together. See, I didn't write it down. Together. Oh, gosh, I love all these words. Gentle. Oh, contentment. These are words that you can write on 
in your journals and postcards, there's Marilyn coming in with love. Good morning, Marilyn. Flourish. These are, yeah, I'm, oh, I'm going to write these to go in my word tin as well. Thank you so much. Um, Mitzi's journals. Hi, so nice to see you. Did I miss anything? Um, Julia, dear, would you just um, tell me what I was writing out there? Um, I'm, yes. Peace. Yes. Motivation. Motivation. Yeah. Deb, I loved seeing your um your little angel you were making yesterday. Oh, it was so nice. Oh, so nice to see you, Mitzi. Mitzi's journals. How lovely to see you. Thank you. Yes, I made that joy. Um, Julia, dear, what word was I spelling out here? Because then I went on to write the others. Is it caring? Caring. I'm presuming caring. Sometimes it's hard to keep the thread of caring. G. G. Oh, I love my, I love my, I love my ransom letters. And I'm spelling that out there. And that will go on there. And I will be using all these other words. I come back this evening. I was spelling out caring. Thank you so much, Brenda. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's lovely. I'm going to pull another prompt now because I'm going to be sticking that on there and using other words on here. It's amazing. This book this time is just going to be so full of all these wonderful things we share together. It's just amazing. Mm. Oh, right. What's it doing? Pull another prompt. Wax crayons or gelatos. Oh, how funny. How funny is that? I could call these ones waxy, but you, it was probably, I put the prompt in there because I wanted to use those. How funny. Already used gelato, but I'm going to come in, I think, with some green. Some green and just I'm making a background for all the lovely journey I'm going to do. Wow. I'm trying not to go on the red paint because it's very gloopy. Hmm. Ah, oh, so nice to see you. All and Beth, thank you, dear, for putting in the prompts. We shall be going over to Rebecca's later, um, soon. Uh, Rebecca, dear, are you streaming today? Probably. I don't know, I'm wondering whether you were streaming last night. Did I see that? I don't get to watch much on a Monday because I we go out for our walk and then I get myself physically and mentally prepared to for our time together <laughs> time is flying isn't it mm. Deb you on your stream you did lots of different ornaments I've particularly taken with your lacy heart winged little angel that you made beautiful absolutely beautiful very scribbly and very primitive, and I love that. It depends what sort of crayons you're using. These are water-soluble ones, so like I did before, I can come in with my brush. <laughs> oh. oh, Petra, I'm so glad you could join us today during the live. That's so nice, so nice that you could be here. Take care, take care. Have a good afternoon mm, and evening. Mm. Girl's got to say goodbye too. Yeah, yeah, you're off. Yes, yes, yeah. And oh, you're going to the doctor's office. What do you have that? Your injection goes well, um, girl, dear. And love to you and your dad this week as well. Yes. Yeah. 
so yeah we can move this paint all around here and I can come I'll come back later and do all that yes <laughs> take care Gail bye Petra take care <laughs> nice to see you so yeah I can move that round a bit more I've got a glorious background here shall we have we've got two more prompts and then it will be it's nearly time to start putting numbers in isn't it tropical leaves wonderful oh i have an idea already i'm going to tuck in here tropical leaf shapes about yay big and uh, there'll be tags and and i will put all these positive words and quotes on lovely and I have here in my oh is it in here yes here because it's something I wanted to do I've got some oh I think I used it when I was doing some slow stitching I've used these as a template so I will draw them make sure they're a bit bigger you might have a tropical um leaf napkin but i'm going to make some tropical leaf tags wonderful <laughs> wonderful uh thank you for putting in those links becca is streaming next wonderful we have a link later for um Oh, how funny. A magazine page background. It's a bit late now for that. So I'm going to say something from a magazine page. I'm just going to write as a prompt, magazine page. So what magazine comes to my hands straight away? <gasps> look away, look away. It's a Daphne's diary. I have been enjoying. <laughs> oh, this is one that Julia gave me in Happy Mat. I should be using that magazine. And you could use magazines for words. <laughs> magazine page. I'm going to. Oh, hello, Renee. So good to see you. So good to see you. Would you like to pop in some numbers? Mm. You finish your shower, you're getting your coffee, you're getting yourself ready. I shall be choosing something from this magazine to put on my page. I'm loving it. Thank you. Oh, pop numbers in. Jennifer, yes. Between one and a hundred. And then yes. And it's on or under the nearest. Pop a number in for yourself and pop numbers in for other people who have been here or people that you know or that you're thinking about. Mm. Mm. Cheryl, thank you for putting in a number for Mary. And we'll be thinking of Mary not just today, over the next coming weeks as she heals from her operation. Yes, definitely. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Jens is putting a number in for Julia. Mm. Mm. Oh, you're back from Thanksgiving, um, Jean. So all your Christmas mugs come out now. You've got quite the collection. What about your Christmas earrings? I've started to wear my Christmas um, earrings now as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> I just look at my page this week. It's just incredible. That's full of positive words and quotes, and it's amazing. Silly question. What? Well, no, there is never no such thing as. A silly question, no, and especially in this world, every world you're in, we, we have sayings and things. I'm always asking questions. It's it's cutting out individual letters from magazines to make up a word, and it's 
someone, yes. So we call them ransom letters. I'm so sorry, yes. A group of letters cut out from a magazine to form a word. Yeah, yeah, no, never any such thing. I'm always asking questions. What is that? How does that work? What is that saying? Yes. And especially when I first came in, it's like, what is an ATC? And yeah, definitely. Hmm. Right. I'm glad you asked. I think this is, yeah, I mean, we, you've probably said it to your daughter. If, some, if you're asking the question, there will be someone else that's asking the question too. Hmm. Right, let's do the ransom numbers again, between one and a hundred ransom numbers. I mean, the random numbers. And I will generate a number because they look like a ransom letter. Yes, yes. <laughs> it's so true. <laughs> My boys laughed when they thought I was right. I was making these. I mean, they really did laugh. Are we ready? Are we all in with numbers now? Hmm. I'm going to generate, press, generate. And number 21, oh, my age. This is a big, shumbled up mess today, my oats. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, yes. Um... Lynn, are you on Instagram or Messenger? Because we can message one another. I'm Janet Nash on Facebook, and I'm chat. Or are you in any of the on Facebook in any of the 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 groups, any of the arty groups, and um, we can contact each other on Messenger or on Instagram. I'm Janet Nash on Janet Nash UK, I think on um, Instagram. Uh, yeah, let, let's. I'll wait for you to say. Let's generate a number. Um, my take of the lake, number twenty-two. Kerr, how this is so? I'm going to be saying number twenty-one. Kerr, send. It's just a tiny little happy mouth. <laughs> so yes, Kerr, how do we swap direct, um, addresses? Are you on? Instagram message, uh, Kerr. Yes, my address is in Beth's group. That's right. Yes. Yes, says we could. Should we message each other on Facebook um, Messenger? Um, Lynn, yeah. Oh, that's Mary's Facebook group above. Thank you. And Kerr, how do I um, contact you? Are you on Messenger or Instagram? Oh, you're going to, don't worry, um, Rebecca, do you? It's going to be a couple of you just getting your coffee. Don't rush, don't rush. <laughs> yes, you are. So let's contact one another on Instagram or Facebook Messenger. Let's try our best. <laughs> Actually, Cole, we have messaged before. I remember. Yes. <laughs> Lynn, does that help? Have I helped you in any way? By mm. And you had number 18 for Little Red Wagon. Is that, um, was that nearest as well? Shall I send something to Renee as well? Yeah, okay, that's fine. Renee from Barbara. Lovely. I'll write all, I'll write all that down and I'll come back in here this evening. Oh, lovely, lovely. Can you put a link in here for your Instagram or will you be able to find me or you're going to say to me, Janet, we already follow each other on Instagram. <laughs> what do you like? <laughs> <sighs> right. Right, that's what I say, isn't it? Let's give Freddie a little end of stream treat. Let's look at our Polaroid. Polaroids have always been a bit ropey. 
but that's our very misty, magical photograph from today's stream. And it's got, it's the films today, they're not all white, they come with different skins. This is red. That will go nicely in this on this page. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, dear. oh, yes, I have an Instagram message from... Yeah, that's Trudy. Yes, yes. Ah, oh, right. Hmm. Ah, oh, Renee's back. Yeah. Oh dear. Is that you've got a puppy, haven't you, um, Renee? Yes. There's Jen's. Oh, Jennifer. Lovely. There's your. You found Jennifer's in Instagram account and I hope Lynn that we spill out to sort that out as well so I need to say oh get Freddie do you want a little treat are you going to get down is this your end of yeah you put links in thank you so much mm. would you mind hopefully um messaging me those um so I've got them yeah thank you Jennifer dear. thank you Thank you so much. Mm. Oh, lovely. <laughs> that was nice, wasn't it? I can't believe it's, oh, I can't believe it's over. <laughs> oh. Thank you, replayers. And thank you, gentle listeners. Um, it's been lovely. You'll find me on Facebook and Messenger. Lynn, thank you. Yes, Little Red Wagon had 18. So, yes, yes. So, we've got Curl with 21 and Rene with 18. I'll send them both something. <laughs> I've got plenty of envelopes made. I laid a towel out there last week. You might have noticed I made plenty of envelopes. Mm. Stephanie was doing some dishes and listening. I'm glad we could keep you company. Goodbye, gentle listeners. And take care. Oh, it's turning some light. To take this light off my face now. Don't need to see the desk. Gosh, is that better? I don't know. It's hard for me to tell. I like that better. Um, mm, no, thank you, Jasper. And goodbye, replays, too. Thank you. And thank you to everybody that's been in chat and for all the positive quotes and words that you've shared with me and everybody and and for all the lovely comments as well where you shared things with me yeah mm. Shannon I'm so glad that you made it with us today that's it's lovely it's been lovely to have you with us yes yes oh bye Barbara bye Renee oh you take care mm. oh Renee says Remember, you are important. Always remember that. Thank you, Renee, for that. <laughs> oh, thank you, Barbara. Barbara's saying goodbye to Freddie and little Flo. She's be she'll be busy. She'll be busy. Bye, Patty. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you. Um, Pam, sleep well, sleep tight. Have a good, have a good um. Tuesday <laughs> when you wake up. Bye bye, Marion. Oh, Marion is coming in with a lo another lovely word there. Let's not stop. Let's keep doing words. Saying <laughs> the grateful. Thank you. I've written that down. Wonderful, wonderful. Jasper. Mm. Yes, Jasper's saying thank you, everyone, for your kindness and inspiration. We do inspire one another, don't we? Yes, yes. Junk jug, you're called junk journal jargon. I think um our lovely um our lovely Jennifer's got it. Thank you, Kerr. Um, Kerr. That's so nice. Yeah, yeah. My take on the lake is Kerr, and she's got a lovely channel too. I enjoy watching. So many people have got um, lovely channels popping some links now as we're out of the door saying goodbye. And um, if someone's able to put a link in for lovely Rebecca, and then we can go over to Rebecca's. Take care, Trudy. You take care and heal well, Trudy. 
thinking of you. Bye, Kelly. Take good care. Oh, yeah. Chin up, everyone, says Jean. Yeah, enjoy those Christmas mugs, Jean. Have a nice hot, hot, hot beverage. Mm. Oh, Anne, so nice to see you. So nice to see you. You take good care. Take good care. And Brenda, Brenda A. Oh, take care. And um, there's Lynn. Take care, Lynn. Bye. And Darlene. Goodbye, Darlene. Goodbye. And Kat. Oh. Have a joy. Kat says, have have a joyfully creative week. Isn't that wonderful to be joyfully creative? Oh, we're still, even at the end of the stream, coming in with our positive words for one another. Mm. Thank you, Irene. Thank you. Okay, coffee done. Yeah, and there's the link. There's the link to Kerr's channel here from Jennifer. Thank you so much, Jennifer. And yes, we'll have the link maybe for Rebecca's no pressure. Um, because seriously, there's never any pressure to do that. Because mm. I know a lot of you are trying to get things done. Take care, everyone. I, I'll um, I'm gonna put the phone down and I will have a nice evening thinking of you all as I... Um, write out all these lovely words and quotes da you take care yeah bye da so nice to see you bye ruth bye happy knitting ruth <laughs> ah. and you cat and you have a great week too i'll pop the phone down we haven't got a link here for rebecca but i think we know the link and we can find create with becca hopefully you um subscribed before i'll see you over there <laughs> take care everyone